Ya to magana a wannan gini da nayi kusan kudin aikin da aka yi kusan dubban na same su yawa dan abin da na yi dama ba gaskiya a cikin kashi uku ko kashi 1 bai dauka ba akan wannan aikin a ni wannan aikin gaskiya bai ta kula ban ga komai ba na yi cikin kwance hankali na gama bai rage man wani abin da zan ci boy gashi a a wannan aiki a ta kula na ba eh to gaskiya daidai yanda ina kiya zan yi karo na biyu ci 23 ba ko da hudu so amazing when you see the kind of transformation in people's lives, especially the small scale farmers. For example, when we started with rice, the yield was less than 4 metric tons per hectare. Now, farmers are recording more than 6, 7, almost getting to 8 metric tons per hectare. And how that has impacted on them is so fantastic and so beautiful to see. <laughs> Masara ta fita sati daya zuwa biyu to kuma damu mukan yi noma ne mu zuba taki haka kawai to kuma yi suka koya mana cewa a ai wannan ba shine ba mu jarraba wannan in mun shuka masaran ta fita ba za ta yi zuwa biyu to hakan kuma da muka yi gaskiya mun ga alfanin shi da a noman da gaskiya da sai dai a noma kamar na ci to amma yanzu gaskiya kusan noman da muke yi ma ba karfin na ci har akan samu kai kasuwa the basic objective of the project is how do we increase the income of the smallholder farmers and all the other actors along the value chain. This we believe we can do if we increase their productivity. A lot of work has been done by the research institutes in coming up with improved seed. It starts from there. The awareness of the use of seeds in crop production is growing. And that's partly due to uh, the activities of Marques too. Strategic Seed Nigeria Limited was a platform for me to enhance crop production among uh, uh, smallholder farmers, especially women and youth. When Marques too came into play and these farmers were trained, it led to increase in quality of the seed we produce because the farmers were now informed. This is what gives the buyer the confidence that if you collect this and plant at least, there will be 91% germination. Empowering the woman means empowering the entire family. There is no limit to what a woman can do. The project aim is to achieve a target of 50% women. In Kaduna State, we have about 20,000 farmers. 40% of them are women. We got to that through the use of female extension agents. Many of them, if they see female, they'll be so motivated to do something better, to have that change they want to have. <laughs> to amma yanzu nan da mun gane maka to sun zo mun sa hannu da su muna yi mun gane so saki yayi kyau sosai mun samu abinci da ba mu samu abinci mai yawa ba yanzu nan mun samu abinci sosai ga shinkafa ga komi da komi ga shinzu zamu samu kuma mu biya ku da yara makaranta mu your eyes are now open they are now seeing they are reaping a lot of benefit from this very technology now by the time a good number of farmers are being empowered this way, it will translate to poverty reduction. Then the whole place will be a safer place to live because nobody will go and steal. Nobody will fight. I have enough to eat. I have enough to cut up for my children's education. And that makes living good.